Well, hello to everybody. This is uh, Charles Richard, and uh, as Orlando uh, starts to open, there's a few restaurants that actually are allowing people to go in and physically, you know, eat inside the restaurants, like places like uh, uh, Burger King. Uh, you know, Burger King is a franchise, and not a lot of the Burger Kings are allowing people to come in and eat inside the restaurant uh, for whatever reason. You know, it's just Burger King is really not one of those restaurants that has a lot of traffic. Uh, but, you know, everybody makes their own decisions and uh, like I said on uh, one of my podcasts, you know, there is what we call a fear factor that is involved in this and that fear factor is really stopping America from opening up because there's still a fear, you know, and they are pretty much, everybody is pretty much uh, the ones that don't open, they just kind of want to uh, sit back and kind of wait and see what happens when everybody else opens before they make the decision to open up. Well, today I am in a restaurant that is um, not as popular but is beginning to open several locations here in the Orlando area and it's called Metro and they're actually have a sit down. It is actually opening. I have ordered an awesome meatloaf as you can see here. Let's see if I can show it to you. Uh, look at that. That is an awesome um, meatloaf on the platter. Uh, and it's very reasonable, it's only like 11 bucks, you know, but uh, they're actually open and you can sit down. I'm actually sitting down right now inside the restaurant eating. And as America keeps opening up and as America keeps um, uh, kind of feeling more confident and that fear factor is kind of uh, overcome, you know, America still is pretty much on a standstill. Uh, and it's not because we can't open, it's because there is a fear factor involved and a, a whole bunch of other scenarios that are really, you know, were not in place before. And um, with the cases that we have here in the Orlando area, we only have 29 deaths in Orlando. That's the only thing that we have that actually you know, uh, by people that actually died because of COVID-19. But when we hear all these things about how the rest of the world did, you know, the fear factor plays a huge fact to put a standstill and for us to be able to come into back to a normal life, you know, and that normal life obviously is one that eventually all of us are going to have to deal with. Either we all are going to keep hiding under a rock or we're going to, you know, say, you know, we need to step out and we need to continue living regardless, you know, whether this COVID-19 is here or not, uh, because uh, we can't live under a rock and expect to uh, pay our bills and expect to uh, feed our families, you know, if there is no income coming. We cannot also uh, rely on the government just to be able to maintain and support us, you know, for however many months it takes to be able to come up with a vaccine because who knows maybe we don't come with the vaccine so what we're supposed to stay back in our own rock or crawl in our own rock and stay home until you know uh, uh, the government runs out of money and then what do we do now we need to become a little bit more self-sustained and a little bit uh, better and uh, be able to do the things that we normally used to do you know so uh, my suggestion is just do it you know when you come out and and you go out into uh, back into uh, the uh, normalization you know uh, part of life you know just do it smartly you know if you do it smartly uh, you'll end up you know being uh, a person that is productive and one that uh, is not uh, creating a uh, more to the fear factor you know anyways this is uh, Charles Richards up here at this place called Metro uh, Metro Diner uh, it's, it's awesome. I'm eating a meatloaf with the mashed potatoes, and I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get to eat because it's, otherwise it's gonna get cold. But uh, this right here, I mean, look at the, just look at that mashed potato. It's, it's like, wow. It's like, oh yeah, mm. it is real, the real American food, you know, that we used to have, you know, that kind of like 
it's no longer this is like oh my god this is my first time i come to this restaurant and it's really really cozy and it's really good i like it i recommend it you know in the meantime you know until next video you know uh this is charles richard you know stay safe you know and uh do the smart